Marcella thanks. Goulet, thanks for joining me. Thank you. You're CMO of Avanade, and you're actually the company's first ever CMO. Um, so talk a little bit about that. First explain, if you, if you don't mind taking a couple quick seconds to talk about what Avanade is and does, for those who don't know, and then talk about why having a CMO was so necessary at this point in its, its history. Yeah, well, Avanab was created in 2000 by Accenture and Microsoft, essentially to help enterprises take advantage of Microsoft technologies to realize results in their business. And since then, um, a company has grown to two billion in sales, um, 22,000 people. Average um, over the last three years, double digit growth uh, above market. And so they really wanted um, to be able to bring marketing to the next step in the journey as the company grows and the business changes and the market change. So, a very exciting opportunity for me. That's great. So, let's talk a little bit about that. How is, you know, how is brand defined in Avanade and sort of what is the role of marketing um, at, a, at a B2B company such as, such as that? Uh, brand in Avanard is really important, clearly as a, a Microsoft innovator, you know, very customer focused, we have a passion for technology. Um, from a marketing standpoint, we wanted a way to be able to uh, get closer to customers, so um, as uh, we're selling more and more solutions and helping companies address business problems uh, and opportunities, particularly you know, now in the digital world, uh, marketing needs to to be uh, listening to customers, helping to develop and create solutions, uh, and promoting those in the marketplace. So you're really you're 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 doing what you're providing for others yeah, for your own company. Yeah. Um, are you borrowing from you know all the um, you know the consumer marketing strategies these days of, of being heavily invested in social and and um, acknowledging the mobile the mobility of your of your target market yeah certainly mobile and social and cloud you know mobile cl first cloud first is really important to us so having digital digital technologies and one of the first things I did when I was joined was to help put in place a marketing automation tool to be able to make our campaigns much more focused and uh, automated and being able to reach out across the company um, being able to learn much more about customers, gathering customer data and insight from that data. Um, we also use social media tools, things you know, like LinkedIn and Twitter and all the things that you would think of uh, in the consumer market. You know, we are, are Avanard ourselves are thinking, okay, how do we take advantage of that? Mm -hmm. you know, how do we make our website much more customized uh, and be able to serve our customers better? And you're the first to acknowledge you're in a very competitive space and so standing out I mean you just go to your website and, and you know you, you basically say a lot of companies can do this sort of thing we're different because of sort of the Microsoft sort of backbone if you will and, and also sort of the, the continuation of, of customer service down the line I mean how hard is it really to distinguish a brand in the market in which you operate these days I think it's all about customers and having good stories to tell together with customers. I mean, we recently um, shared a, about our work with Delta Airlines, helping them improve the mobile in-flight experience. You know, working with Coles, very exciting on um, connected fitting room pilot, and it's those kinds of stories where we talk with our customers about what we're doing together uh, that's innovative out there, which helps us to really stand out and differentiate. And it, it's exciting. You know, yeah. to to, to be able to do those kinds of things together. So you're, you mentioned customers. Talk a little bit about, you know, um, what are the biggest pain points that your customers are dealing with right now, certainly from a, from a marketing and sales point of view? I think as um, you know, there's a lot of talk about the convergence of mobile, social, data, and cloud, uh, and our customers are trying to figure out, okay, how do they take advantage of that? You know, whether it's through the digital experience for customers or whether it's digital uh, in the workplace. So having sort of context and tools and information so that people like field workers can provide a better service or improve knowledge sharing uh, across the company to make it faster and more effective going to market. Um, there's also the innovation that comes from digital where companies are seeing different competitors. You know, their markets are changing. Um, and, and competitors can spring up overnight. Those are the things that are on the minds of our customers and you know, where we, we help them. 
Talk a little bit about shifting gears somewhat. You, you, I said earlier, you're the first CMO for the company. Um, you're also a woman in that role. And I know Avanat has a great sort of um, women's um, um, sort of leadership um, support plan in place. Mm. Can you talk a little bit about that? Because I think that's fascinating, especially um, you know, being in an IT company and, and essentially heading up the, the marketing role, the headed marketing role. You know, what unique challenges do you think you face? How do you stay, you know, work within sort of um, uh, an area that isn't, hasn't historically been known for having a lot of women be part of parcel of that? Yeah, it's certainly harder to get women, young girls, women into STEM, you know, mm -hmm. science, technology, engineering, and math. And um, I was recently at a Pink, Pink Cloud event run by Microsoft in Italy, and it was wonderful to see 600 young women there um, of college age thinking about careers in STEM and, and talking and encourage them. So you know, we believe that diversity is important to the strength of the business, and we're very committed to that. Um, we celebrate uh, Women's Day uh, with lots of different initiatives. We have um, a mentoring program that we put in place for sort of manager and uh, level women to help them um, in their journey in, on, in their careers. Uh, a lot of different uh, mentoring as well. I mean, I mentor a, a lot of young women across the company, as do others, you know, m male colleagues too. What's next for the Avenade brand as we move forward? What can we expect to see? under your leadership? Continuing to focus on innovation. Um, we also have a sponsorship with Formula One, um, oh, which cool. is, and you asked about consumer and where do we lend, so sports, sports sponsorship. Um, and it's different for us because we've been helping the Lotus team uh, with their technology, helping them with the data that they need for the track. It's, it, you wouldn't imagine the kind of data and the information that they, they use in their supply chain. So it, it, it raises our awareness, but it also tells a few more stories about how we working together with uh, uh, um, you know, customers and, and helping to improve uh, the, their, their business.